what's up you guys if you're new here hi hello i'm lydia welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if you are new today i wanted to talk about how i overcame slash recovered from a nervous breakdown what a lot of you don't know is when me and becca broke up it pushed me very down and when i moved to brighton i couldn't cope i had a breakdown in which i tried to kill myself and i was admitted on a section to mental health unit how why it's important to talk about this is so many people go through a breakdown and they don't know how to cope with it. The way I recovered was through a lot of self-help books, medication changes and overall just becoming more myself. It got to a point where I couldn't talk. The important thing here is you're not alone if you're going through a breakdown or if you think you've got a breakdown coming on. There are things you can do to help yourself. Let's see a psychiatrist, get medication sorted, go to therapy, try not to isolate yourself. What the breakdown felt like to me was everything I'd worked hard to build up just came crashing down. It took me a year to fully recover and I'm still not 100% there. You have to give yourself time to recover. Also I'm filming this on my new camera so I hope the quality is better. The important thing to me when I went for a breakdown was having friends and family support you. For me it just felt like the world was ending. I didn't think I was going to come out the other end. And I nearly didn't. Because I didn't understand why I couldn't think. But what pushed me into the breakdown was the breakup between me and Becca. Losing someone important in your life is a damn hard thing to deal with. If you are experiencing symptoms like worsening speech, head blur, dissociation, go and speak to your doctor and say I think I'm having a breakdown. That's all I've got for this video. If you are new make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, turn notifications on so you never miss a video and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.